I'm Jovita, and thanks for stopping by. This is my kitchen, Jovita's Kitchen. I'm glad you came by because today's video, it's really cold outside, and this is soup weather. This is creamy wild rice soup from Tastefully Simple, and this is about keeping warm and also being uh, full. We're going to have a good soup today with Tastefully Simple. And what you need is a package of the wild rice soup mix. And then you need a package of your favorite vegetables. These are frozen vegetables that we have here. And then I just, I love onions and garlic. So I chopped up some onions and have some garlic. And we're going to add in a can of cream of chicken soup. And then uh, we have some, we have to add in five cups of water. And what I like to add in, and you can add in the meat of your choice, but today since saving time, I didn't uh, bake any chicken. You can bake chicken or have hamburger meat. And so today we're going to use chunky breast chicken. And so with that being said, uh, one other thing I wanted to add on too about, I wanted to show you about my little can opener here. This is from Pamper Chef. And this, I love this can opener. You put it on here and go around the edges. And then, okay, and all you have to do is take the top off of the can. Look, no cutting edges. This is good. You have kids in the kitchen and you don't cut yourself or anyone doesn't get cut. This is a very good survival tool for you to have from Pepper Chef. This is the a good can opener. Okay, with that being said, we're going to start making our soup. Okay, what I like to do is with the onions and garlic, I like to saute them a little bit before I put them in my, uh, in my soup mixture. One more cup and I'll be adding some more Uh, the rest of my ingredients. This was the soup mix. And you can chop up the chicken. These are chicken breasts. And just chop that up in the can. And then I just add everything in. And I'll turn my stove for, to get the water boiling up on high. Just let the onions sweat a little bit, and that's real quick. Smelling good already. And now I'll mix everything in here and set it on high and wait for it to come to a boil. Okay, now that we have it up to a slight boil, I'm going to add in the vegetables. And let it continue to cook. Now you can make this as thick as you want to, and I need to add in my uh, one cup that I needed to add in from earlier. This is a, the fifth cup. And 
And we're going to bring it back up to a boil to make sure that it's cooking. And then we're going to turn it down low to let it simmer. You can also do this in the crock pot as well. And it can simmer anywhere from two to four hours because this is soup. Okay, it's been about five to 10 minutes and we've let this come up to a boil. We have all our ingredients in here. And so we're gonna let this simmer for another 30 minutes. But this is the consistency and you can have uh, as thick as you want to or let's not make this too thin, but this is our soup. And we're gonna let this simmer. While we're waiting on the soup to get ready, I had wanted to talk a little bit more about this can opener from Pampered Chef. This is a very unique idea and you just set it on the top and you make, you twist it one way and then you twist it back and, and you go around the can a few times and then you're able to take it with this little thing and clip off and you're able to take off the top to the can. And there's no sharp edges, none whatsoever, and so no one gets cut. This is a great idea. I only needed to use half of this can because this wasn't a regular, when I looked at my can, I needed only one can of chicken, uh, cream of chicken soup, and then I didn't need this whole can. So while I'm cooking, I was able to put the lid back on. And so with that, I kept it safe for having the lid on here and no one can get cut and it's also kept to uh, keep anything out of here until I'm able to put it in something else to store this. Please do not store this can in the refrigerator. Not good. So this is just until I can get back to it and put this into something else. And this is a very good survival tool with all the things that people are storing up with. They're storing up a lot of canned goods to keep it for, um, keep them shopping, um, their uh, uh, survival kits and everything. And you need a good can opener. And this is good. You won't get cut with this can opener. And it's a very good idea from Pamper Chef. And I will put this down in my description below so you can order your can opener or give them as gift. These will make a very good gift. So we'll get back to our soup in just a second. The soup has been simmering for over 30 minutes and I've been stirring in between to making sure that it's not sticking or getting scorched. And most people know me, I like a little pizzazz in my, in my seasoning. And what this is, is Nature Sunshine Capsamen, which is hot pepper. And so I like to add a little bit of hot pepper and this is also good for cold and flu season so with it being cold outside this will really warm you up so I add a little bit of the seasoning and stir it in and ooh wee ooh wee I can't wait to get a bowl of this oh, and settle in for the evening. This is soup weather. What's in your bowl of soup? Mm. Tastefully simple. Has some ideas and I do too. Come see me, Jovita's Kitchen. Mmm. Like, share, and subscribe.